right, so radiology is where I just came from. So it just came out of radiology. Uh, these are the steps right next to the east basement. The morgue's right here. Uh, so I'm guessing I have to go up these steps in order to get back to the main hallway. All right, it's radiology. Now I'm up the steps. So, oh, this map's gonna be hard. Mm. Looks like the map only tells me about the lower half, not the upper half. Hmm. Let's see. The fuck? Um. Know what that means. Uh, right, this is where I was at before I came up here. It's locked from the other side. Right, right, right. Can't read what that sound says. It says radiology down there, but what is... Oh, right. This is where the uh, thing... Oh, wait, hold on. No. I guess I need some kind of star key. Oh, there's a map. The upper floors. See a waiting room, pharmacy, delivery, new porn room, maternity. So this must be a hall. Okay. So these are all lit up now. Oh, I can go in them. Bloodstained ledger. Maintenance crew logbook. Lucas Houston, uh, Huston. Evening shift. Electrical maintenance. 1445. The nurse told me that the lamp was malfunctioning in the more, uh, maternity ward. When I turned on the light, I could see that one of the bulbs in the wall was indeed flickering. As I was getting ready to change it, a man came out of nowhere and grabbed me by the shoulders, pushing me back with strength unimaginable for someone his age. He told me not to touch it. I didn't want to argue with him, so I simply left. I can't stop thinking about it. Why did the old man prevent me from touching from touching it? Let's check it out. Apparently that um did not end well for this guy. Alright. There's an issue with the electrical generator. The pressure of the gas must be exact for it to ignite. The pressure is written on the Alright, figure that out, buddy. Alright, took care of that whole situation. the part of the plastic card uh, combined it's a full plastic card now uh huh oh hello wow um use doesn't fit huh Nothing happened. Um, let's 
Let's see. If I hold on to that. Order switched off. Order switched off. Oh. It's on the other side of the room. So I got the plastic heart. I guess I could put it back uh, in the mannequin? I'm guessing. Anything else over here? Full of various medicines. Uh, where was that room? With the mannequin. Uh, wasn't down here, was it? it might have been. Hold on. Okay. Had to be before I got down here then. Why was that other electronic door at? No, it was downstairs, wasn't it? Mass Jesus. Was it this door? No, this is general. Uh, um, this is what the hell. I guess it was upstairs. Yeah, it must have been upstairs. Oh, I can see I'm going to get turned around a lot in this game. I would not learn this layout at all. Right up the steps. This is where the angels were. Uh, the angel painting. Hey, is there something here? Looks like something was there. The restroom. Um, oh, this is where I woke up at. Looks like I spawned something. Oh. Running? Alright. I feel like it. Is that, is that gas tank attached to his asshole? That's fucked up. Wait, what? 
for that. Oh, okay. So this is where I came out at. Smack. What? Am I dead? Oh, I died. Did I? F Wait, I couldn't save. Are you serious? I gotta start all over? Are you serious? I couldn't fucking save. Do this room right now. Where are they? Aim at that one. Ninja gun. The fuck? All right. It's taken care of. Now. Did I get this before? Go to the latest archaeological discoveries. The one I like. Oh, yeah, 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 I did. to go in there. An old magnetophone. It looks like it works. Recording my progress might be useful if anything happens to me. You think? My name is Caroline Walker. I came to Wild Burger Mansion seeking information about two girls in a photograph I received in the mail a couple of weeks ago. The last thing I remember before losing consciousness was arriving at the hospital and entering the mansion's main hall. I remember pain and then nothing. I woke up sometime later connected to a ventilation machine. And my eye had been removed. Why? Why would someone do such a thing? You're still hot. I don't know what the hell is going on in this place, but I need answers. Every time I close my eyes, I see those girls. Am I going insane? Yes. Progress saved. All right. Nothing of interest. Not plugged in. Morphine. I knew I was missing some morphine. Missing. All right. Can't open that. 
that. What's this? This is open now. Uh, I don't have enough bullets. Uh, I don't have enough bullets for that. I need to get some more bullets. I don't know. Maybe I can. Nah, I need more bullets. She doesn't have a melee attack. Wait, can I equip this crowbar? Can I? <laughs> oh, if I would have known. Come here, motherfucker. Anybody here. And morphine. Good, good, good. Hmm. Help. That does say help, right? For the nail god. <clears throat> Oops. As I crept quietly behind my father, the clock struck 1.30 a.m. I saw him enter the ma mausoleum after placing three elements on some kind of board. He went through quietly. I followed him at a distance, trying not to make a sound, for I did not want him I did not want to be caught. At mother's tomb, my father sank to his knees and rested his hands on the cold sculpted marble figure. As his wife he began figure of his wife. He began praying. I felt guilty following him, seeing the cold and calculating man this way moved me. I was about to leave when father stood up and approached the angel statue. Mother's marble tomb moved slowly to the side and exposed a narrow staircase leading into a darkness. He climbed down the stairs. I hesitated for a moment, my legs not wanting to take another step, but was able to stand and follow him down. Once inside, I heard metallic sounds and the echo of running water. A few moments, a few moments later, Excuse me. A few moments later, I bumped into a ladder. I climbed down and found myself in a long stone tunnel covered in pipes and sewage. I saw Father's silhouette turning the corner and hurriedly followed. Before me appeared a huge metallic door and a group of men wearing strange suits like those worn to protect from radioactivity. Each carried a giant hammer. My father joined the group and they received him by hitting their hammers together. A hospital bed on each side of the group carried what appeared to be bodies covered in sheets. My father put me put on one of the disturbing suits. In my frightening stupor, I loosened a brick from the wall. It smashed against the floor with the sound of a thousand buildings crashing down. I could feel their eyes turn to me as I fled back. The way I had came, their guttural voices screaming to catch me while they hit their hammers on the ground. Wow. Kid, you fucked up. Yes, uh, we're not going to say anything about the guts on the floor. Can I do anything with these x-ray images? I probably have to add one. Most likely. I, I can hear you. Not exactly sure where you are, but I can hear you. Just in case, 
I don't make it home tonight. Let me reload you for the last time, baby. So I have to, <laughs> I have to posture up. She got some thighs, yeah. That would hurt. She might have some power behind that, <laughs> you know. Did not beat up this guy. I thought I bashed this guy already. Did I not? Time to post up. Post up. <laughs> uh. I think I can take one more hit. I cannot take another hit. I can. Alright. Alright, how much did that heal? By Oh, that doesn't heal as much as I thought. Huh. All right. I think I kind of have an idea how I'd have to do this. I have to weaken him with this. When I get knocked down, I switch to the uh, the pipe crowbar and uh, finish him off. I'm guessing that's what I'm gonna have to do. Oh wait, no, no, no. This is the uh, room I woke up in. I swear I see something over here flashing. I'm pretty sure it's just some kind of weird reflection, but... Alright, so we went through there. Uh, we went in here, right? Yes. And I can't use a plastic heart with this guy. Correct. Doesn't fit. Huh. Doesn't fit. Hmm. Does not fit. There's nothing over here. Huh. Okay, uh, where else could I go? This place is pretty big. Hex gone, huh? I don't think I can use this at all. Oh, hex gone and a soldier. That's four. Hmm. Okay, I'm obviously overlooking something because uh, there's nowhere else to go. So, either A, I haven't picked up something, or B, I'm an idiot. I'm thinking it's B. There, let's uh, take my ass downstairs. in this room that's locked and that's just a generator room that's a corpse made that uh... you may find how can it's on the second floor of the east wing thank you all right so I do have to get up there so maybe there is a way to get up there and I'm just not noticing it. 
some back there? No. Alright. I don't want to go back there. Huh. Huh. It's a mystery. I don't think I'm missing anything out of the generator. I mean, the lights are on now, so I can't actually see in here now. So. Uh, no, I don't think I'm missing anything. And I do have this part that I believe is a hexagon. So maybe there. Like I said, it can't go in here. Well, I can, but there's no point. Uh. All right. So this is the east wing. This is the thing about the guy. Uh, would advise against transferring them. Requires an immediate transplant. The patient passed away at 11:34 due to cardiac arrest. Yeah, I'm holding a metal object instead of rigor mortis. I would remove it. Um, I'm looking for a heart, but I got the plastic one. So the only doors that I can go through are up here and down there. And this one is locked from the other side. This one over here has these motifs. So over the keyhole. place in there. Could try to use this. Nothing happened. Yeah. Well, I'm thinking I need to do something with that guy. Because I believe that's the key to get in. But his heart doesn't fit. left open in the middle of a procedure her heart is missing uh, this This will help it. Doesn't fit. <laughs> the fact that I can even attempt that. Uh, hmm. There has to be some way to shrink this. Try putting it into the uh, mannequin. That doesn't work. Hmm. I wonder, can I? Oh, no, it's not with me anymore. Yeah. 
stable reading of the vital signs and monitor. Stable reading of the vital signs and monitor. What else can I do with this? this. You know, there was a, a door in here that I can't open. Where is it? Yeah, this little fence right here. Doesn't fit. Doesn't fit. Definitely would fit. I'm missing something. Oh, I pr it's probably that thing in the guy's hand that I'm missing. There's nothing I can do with this. I can have a torso. Huh. Can I hit him? Maybe? No. Drinking Coke at this place. Must got a pretty sweet deal. Hmm. I'm pretty sure you have the heart that I'm looking for there, buddy. Because uh, it should fit inside the mannequin, right? Could I be missing? Then there's you that's here. Take a number. Oh, service window. It's on the side. Another image that I have to put up there? Is that what it is? Looks nothing useful. Like, seriously, we're, I've stepped in this several times. Uh, 
that. What about this? Surgical tools. Surgical tools. Leaning off like this before, and I may have painted by Fusil in 1781. Picks a woman in a deep sleep. Oh, uh, yeah, this is the one with the egg. Mm. Sitting on her chest. What could be missing? Maybe there is something in this this, this room. I, I just overlooked. Uh, anything else here? Right. Spread it and do to me. Aspirator. It's the tub. No, there's nothing else in here. I don't. I, know, I haven't seen any soldiers. That's the only thing that I can think of is this one little thing right here that shows a pentagram and a soldier. <sighs> on a diving helmet. Like, that doesn't make any sense. Saying heart attack on the way down. Uh, maybe it's one of those radiation suit guys. Because in the book, it did talk about how. Uh, It did talk about how uh, they had like these hammers or something like that. January 1967, William promote, promised me that moving into the mansion where the city hospital is located would be the best for us, that it would allow us to spend more time together these days. However, I find him spending every waking hour at work. I fell asleep waiting for him at night. His passion for medicine is what made me fall in love with him in the first place. Am I being selfish? Well, I, don't, I don't think so. Today is one of the happiest days of my life. William came running into the room searching for something. His eyes traveled around the room, giving me no more than a few seconds of attention. But then he looked at me again. His eyes opened wide. William came to me and put a hand on my forehead. He pressed his fingers on my wrist and looked at me for a few seconds, unbelieving. His voice faltered when uh, he spoke. <clears throat> We're going to have a baby? He said, I felt sick. 
William took the rest of the day off. He acted like a child, laughing and speaking of the future, holding my hand in the whole time that that night we heard a noise coming from underground. It sounded like metal being struck over and over. We could not fall, uh, we could not find sleep until early morning. Uh, wow. You didn't uh, think something was up with that? Oh, okay. So it's all part of the diary. <clears throat> uh, so it's you guys working on something in the basement. <clears throat> Thank you. I'm actually glad I came back through here. <laughs> some more nails. It's actually quite a big help. Alright. Damn it. This I would try it. Might as well. See what happens when I go into that room with the uh, what you call it? Maybe something with the lights. I don't know. Can't really think of too much stuff. Outside of that. Does now, huh? No, I'm going now. All right, he's how many can the torso? Oh, my God. Nope, I didn't do shit. I need the, I need the power on. Wait, hold on a second. Why are you over here now? Are you fucking with me? So turn the light off does change things, huh? Examine. Uh, it's gonna suck. It's missing a handle. All right. So it's missing a handle. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Maybe I could try that. Maybe I could attach that piece onto the hexagon and see if he lets it go after that. Why, uh, why did I get confused? I can. I took the long way around. Up the steps. Uh, 
Attached it. Fuck. Damn it. There's got to be a way to get this fucking heart to fit in him. Understand. Uh, okay, okay, okay. So maybe there's a vice. Maybe I can. Can I take these out of him? Press use. Alright, maybe yeah, if I put that there. No. No, it doesn't fit, doesn't fit, doesn't fit. Oh. Wait a minute. What the fuck? Right. The light. He said there was something wrong with the light. An old man came and grabbed him, told him not to touch it. Oh, I'm an idiot. I was so focused on the uh, heart thing that I didn't even think about that. Oh, I can go in any direction I want. Didn't I know that? 